Jacqueline Fernandez in her uh, cameo or in a special performance in Radhe does the song Dil De Dia. I guess by then the audience are shouting Chen Loot Lia. This in short is Salman Khan's Eid outing Radhe. I guess there's a problem with Prabhu Deva. He must stick to what he's very good at, dancing, maybe even choreography. But given his filmography as a director, he must learn his lessons. The problem is that success comes, and success comes to many of his films, as a consequence of which he begins to believe that he's a good filmmaker. Wanted and Dabang 3 brought Salman Khan and Prabhu Deva together. This time round, you really are tired both of Prabhu Deva and surely of Salman Khan. One line story, the encounter specialist, ever transferred, bad at work, Inspector Radhe, the protagonist, is brought back to duty to nab a drug peddler and the entire Bombay police force is out to get one drug peddler, Randeep Huda. Now it speaks poorly <coughs> of the intelligence of the police. It talks even less about how they cannot handle a drug peddler without having to break the law and how there is mayhem by the time he is finally apprehended and killed. This instant justice mantra that our cinema seems to project time and again to make heroes out of the Macme idols of our cinema is steadily telling the public that heroics is more important than the rule of law. A very dangerous precedent and it is repeated time after time and this is one more film there. Unfortunately, this one line story of the cop going to catch the drug peddler has nothing to, I repeat, absolutely nothing to recommend in its favor. Salman Khan looks he's 70. I seen a few interviews recently on a television channel with dad Salim Khan. He looks a tad younger. He and Disha Patni are woefully mismatched. I would wonder why somebody would take a script of this kind and make a film out of it. The entire film is only about people thrashing up one another. Rods, broken glass pieces, dirt dust, unkept men share more skin space with Salman Khan in Radhe than Disha Patni does, or for that matter anybody does. Randi Puda as the drug peddler believes that if he wears black clothes, grows his hair, looks morose, he's a villain. Doesn't work. Nothing in fact works in this movie. Not Salman's magic. He may tear his shirt again, but that magic is gone. There are very few who are going to fall for his torso now. Age shows below his eyes and he's trying to play a role he just can't carry. The film is ridiculous. It is a hundred and odd minutes question on your intelligence. There is there are scenes where you wonder whether it's Jackie Shroff or a caricature that's moving. He looks comic sometimes and uh, sometimes worse. Nobody in the film is worth talking about. This Radhe needs the dump. The graphics are comical. The cast is torturous. The script is non-existent. The performances are decimal. In spite of all this, if 
you are a Salman Khan fan. My sincere advice to you is, if you want to continue to be his fan, stay away from the film. For the rest, just stay away. In these morbid days, you don't need any additional dosages. And this is what this film gives you in large quantities. This Prabhu Deva film makes you say, Oh Prabhu, Oh Deva, why are you doing this to the audience? Thank you.